Hey everybody. Yeah, I am going home. I enjoy doing this. I'm driving and talking at the same time. You know, I'll never forget in that classic Raising Arizona. Nick Nolte, the Nick Nolte character, had just gotten fired from his job, and I forgot exactly why he got fired. But his 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 buddy, who was a who was a career criminal, had been staying with him a couple of days, and he goes, "Yeah, I just got fired from my job. I think his name was Frederick Forsyth. He was an actor that everybody would recognize, but nobody knows his name." He goes, he goes, "Yeah, I lost my job today, but Bill or whatever his name was." He goes. He said, well, you're young, got your health. What you need a job for? And he was as serious as a heart attack. And, of course, we all laughed. Because it's obvious that everybody needs a job. Everybody needs to do something to justify your life. Like a dog. Do we go, hey, dog, go do your job. Nobody needs to. Nobody feels that way. Nobody sits around worrying about, well, my dog could be pulling, pulling the sled. My dog could be doing this. My dog could be doing that. When the, the indigenous people that used to be alive, they didn't keep a dog around. They didn't keep a dog around just to be a friend. They kept a dog around to watch. They had a watch dog. They had a dog there for a reason. Their dogs worked. Now we've gotten where our position's worse than a dog. We think we have to work to justify our life. I mean, I was telling this to this chick that I'm dating in the Philippines. I told her to get a life because she was bothering me so much that she didn't have a life. So I told her to get a life. Well, I guess she's already got a life. That's why she can call me. I'm the one who needs to get a life because that's all I do is work. Bye.